So in 1805, this joined the Bridgewater Canal. This joined the Bridgewater Canal. And the result was, we're still before the railway age here, 25 years before Liverpool Manchester Railway, this area just became a boom town, a boom area. In fact, well, I can illustrate this for you with one simple illustration. These canals by the 1820s, this, this stretch here, started to work on Sundays. Now the Sabbath, the Sunday was a day when people didn't. Such were the jams, the barge jams, stretching back and waiting to get through this point that they decided they, they, they started to work on a Sunday to clear them. Yeah, they had a protest by the two. Well, they were, pro they were, they were clearly protests, yes. I mean, we, we, know that we, we know this from the records. Uh, by the middle of the 1820s, 18, uh, 18, <coughs> 18, 18, um, I'll just look at that. Um, that book on it, because when we were doing this, we, we stumbled across the most fantastic photograph. Um, this. Actually, here on the bridge. I don't know, can you see? Well, I can pass it round, I can pass it round. Here, here's a photograph. Uh, actually, the date, the date we now know is wrong. At the time, we thought it was roughly that. Um, but it's, it's again, it's at the end of the 19th century, and this is this area, photographed by someone having a camera over here and looking towards these viaducts. <coughs> Across here, yeah? You see? Oh, right. And what, but the important point here is this the barges tucked in down here, waiting, double parked, <laughs> <laughs> all waiting. It's cold, it's cold. Of course, it's cold. Have a, uh, 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 have a look at that and um, 